Satyarup Siddhanta has become the second Indian mountaineer after Malli Mastan Babu to climb Mount Ojas del Salado, the highest volcano in the world. Ojas del Salado is a volcano in the Andes on the Argentina Chile border and the highest active volcano in the world at 22,615 feet. In the past, Siddhanta has achieved several feats against all odds. Siddhanta has conquered the highest peak in the world, the Mount Everest. He skied the largest degree to the South Pole and hoisted the Indian flag at minus 40 degrees centigrade. A thing worth noting is that Siddhanta fought against asthma in his early days to bring his dream of mountaineering to reality. Siddhanta's hunger for conquer is more undying and now Siddhanta is aiming to be the first Indian to climb Mount Sidley, the highest volcano of Antarctica which will help him realize the dream of scaling seven summits and seven volcanic summits. Pretty, quite a feat. Uh, earlier going to North Pole and South Pole was a feat. That was an expedition. There are no more expedition or voyages. Every part of the world has been mapped. So the only voyage or expedition left is for space. But there are certain areas in Antarctica uh, where people have not gone or if gone not stayed much. And perhaps this would be the highest peak. One of the toughest places to be in the world. excruciating exercise to be taken up by anyone. So these are the visuals of Satyarup Siddhanta, his challenges and what he wants to do. And I'm now joined by uh, Satyarup Siddhanta. Uh, Siddhanta, thank you very much uh, for making time for Vion. Welcome on Vion and let me uh, let me uh, take the opportunity to ask you the question. What has made you decide that you are going to climb the highest peak in Antarctic? Siddhanta, uh, can you uh, can you hear me? I think bit of a technical problem with the Satyarup Siddhanta, but nonetheless, he is the man to watch out because he has decided that he, after climbing the highest uh, volcano in the world, he is going to uh, he will try to conquer the highest summit. in Antarctica, the highest volcano of Antarctica. It's not going to be an easy task, but that's what uh, he has decided to do. That's the goal he has set for himself. So these are the visuals of great achievement of a person an Indian who has climbed the highest volcanic peak. Now he intends to do that in Antarctica. Bit of a technical problem in uh, getting him on board, but the fact of the matter is that he's one of the international Indian achievers. And now he has set himself a very, very difficult goal. Uh, Satyarup, uh, tell me, uh, you know, you have climbed the highest uh, uh, volcano in the world. Why have you set uh, yourself a target of climbing the highest volcano in Antarctica? Uh, I think that, that that should be the toughest assignment ever. Yeah, this mountain is a, a very tricky mountain and it is a very remote mountain. Um, only in the whole world, uh, hardly 20 people have uh, climbed this mountain, even less. And uh, this is a part of my seven volcanic summits uh, challenge. And uh, uh, if I can make it happen, which I know I will make it happen, this will become a world record in mountaineering, in the history of mountaineering. So I will become the youngest 
mountaineer in the world to finish the seven summits and the seven volcanic summits. So uh, I'm very excited about this. Uh, it is a little costly uh, expedition, which it will cost at least 50 lakh rupees. And I'm looking for uh, brands which can resonate with uh, this kind of passion. And uh, I would be happy to associate with them. Uh, Satyuru, what was it like to be on the highest volcano uh, in the planet, on Andes? What was the feeling like? Yeah, it was uh, a different feeling. I mean, like when I climbed Mount Everest, it was uh, a different kind of feeling. But when I went to Chile and climbed uh, this Ojos del Salado uh, at the Atacama Desert, uh, so it, it's, it's a totally different kind of mountain. And uh, it's very cold. And uh, I mean, it shattered all the uh, beliefs that I had for volcanoes. And um, I, I think it was uh, amazing. And uh, uh, also, I was very fortunate that uh, I could go and uh, pay homage to Let Malli Mastan Babu uh, to the mountain at Mount Tres Cruces, which is nearby that mountain uh, where he died. Uh, so it was a very special journey. And especially it was just after my seven summits, I went to Antarctica. I climbed the highest mountain in Antarctica, then went to South Pole and I skied the last uh, degree, which is around 111 kilometers. I skied to reach the South Pole. Uh, and then I came to Chile and climbed uh, this uh, highest volcano in the world. Um, and um, uh, it's, it, it's always uh, very uh, good to, uh, like, you know, I feel very proud to flood up the India flag at all the corners in the world. But Satyaru, you know, before I let go of you, you know, these expeditions take a toll on your body, you know. In, in, the body feels the pain, you know. Uh, but what makes you keep on going again and again? back for such excruciating uh, expeditions? Yeah, I think it uh, gives me a high because uh, uh, as a kid I was an asthmatic uh, patient.